Hi guys, I'm Bume, and if like me, you've just gotten yourself an MTN Uncapped deal, you must have received your free to use premium root app. So it should be easy to use right out the box, but I've got some extra tips to help you get connected. Let's get unboxing. I have the ZTE 5G. You might have the ZTE 286, but it works perfectly the same. Here we got our router, our power supply, as well as our SIM card. And slide it right here. Now to find the best spot in the house. This should be near power connections and the devices you wanna get connected to. You can connect via Wi-Fi or plug your devices into the router. So we've plugged in our router and switched the power on. Let me tell you what the different lights mean. The first one's to show our power is on. The second light is our Wi-Fi connection. The third light being our network. And lastly, our signal strength. Once your network light is blue, you're connected to MTN. Now to connect your device to your Wi-Fi. You need to know the Wi-Fi name and the password. This is found under your ZTE router. So switch on your Wi-Fi and look for the router name. Found at ZTE, select and enter your password. And just like that, you're connected. At this point, you should be able to start browsing and streaming from your device. But what happens if you're unable to? The first thing to check is the status of your lights on your router. Check that you have power, and if so, check that the net is status indicator. It should be blue. If this is red, it means there is a problem. Normally, this can be one of two things. Firstly, make sure that you are using your router in the same area you provided when you signed up for your deal. Your router is locked to a specific area, and if you move outside of the area, you will need to contact MTN to unlock it. Secondly, it can be a simple result of an incorrect setting on the router. Let's check that now. I am going to check the settings via my mobile phone, but you can do so from a computer or any other devices, provided you have the device connected to the router via the Wi-Fi or via network cable. Once the device is connected, open the web browser on your device and go to site 192.168.0.1. Type in the router password, which is admin, and click login. Under section 2, my router, be sure that the connection is disabled. Next, click settings and on the next screen, click APN. Leave the PDP type as is. Enter a name for the profile, such as MTN Home. And now if you have an unkept plan, as the APN, you can type in My MTN Home. Once done, click Apply, then Set as Default. You can return to the previous screen, and under My Router, you can now switch on the connection. That's it! Now check the network status indicator on your router. If the settings are correct, it should change from red to blue. After a few minutes, if it stays red, this could be due to a different problem and you need to contact MTN for assistance. Thanks for watching. Hopefully all is well and you're connected to the MTN Bosnia network. Enjoy.